Stevie Campagno here, aka the Fat Burning Trainer. Today I'm going to share with you how adding one corporate fitness client can make you almost $10,000 a year. Right now you're looking at a screenshot from my Stripe account. Pacific American Group, which we're going to talk about today, they have paid almost $30,000 in less than three years. And if I can do this, there's no reason why you guys can't do the same. Today I'm going to show you a play-by-play -play of the corporate fitness onboarding process, how I got them as my client, and action steps for you to do this yourself. Three reasons why I prefer corporate fitness. It's a small following solution that doesn't require you to post all day. It's a high ticket sale that doesn't require extensive phone support and babysitting. Can you, can you imagine if you had an individual fitness client paying $10,000 a year, how many calls and how much support you'd have to do with that client? You don't have to do that with corporate fitness. If people are using the app, getting results, and setting new personal best, making new achievements, the decision maker is never going to cancel the account. Now here's one of my corporate accounts. Today we're going to go over Pacific American Real Estate simply because the lady in the middle, Linda, said I can share this with you guys. A picture of their team members using the app just in case you guys think I'm full of BS. Here's the corporate fitness meeting I had with Pacific American Real Estate. Now you're not going to be able to treat this just like a one-on-one -on -one individual fitness client. You're going to have to do this uh, demo over Zoom or in person. I created a pitch deck that I made on a PowerPoint on Google Slides. If you guys want, you can click the link in the description, schedule a call with me, and then I will share with you the PowerPoint that I use to close the corporate sales. It's basically the same PowerPoint that's just customized to the companies. And you guys can easily customize this to your business too. So make sure you go in the description and schedule a call with me and I'll share it with you. This is a pitch deck that I used and I had to keep it cutty, right? I don't want to have my phone out being like, okay, you know, this is what not to expect during the meeting, right? I had to be pretty, uh, pretty sneaky about it, but they ended up signing up as a result, ended up paying $9,408 for the year. I told my uh, followers on Upscale Trainer that I would do this, and I just had to follow through on that. So I ended up filming it. If you guys want to check it out, go to the Upscale Trainer Instagram account. Three key points that got Linda attracted to corporate fitness. Right? She liked the idea that it was going to increase sales and productivity for the company. She wanted happy long-term employees. By doing this, she's adding value to the company, which is going to help people stay longer. It's going to decrease uh, employee sick days and healthcare costs. She loved that as well. My retention strategy, like I said, you guys don't need to get on the phone with all these different individuals, right? What you should do is you just send screenshots and put them all on a PDF document I just go by user, so for example, in this case, Theron's one of the users. So we had we were scrolling through, and this was Theron's section. As you can see, he had a bunch of new personal best. Here's all of our communication. And I'm just talking to you, just like I am on this video, same concept with the CEO, right? I just I created a screen share video and just went through all these different users' accounts to show the decision maker that, hey, look, this person is getting results. We're communicating on a frequent basis. If they see all this stuff, they're never going to cancel the account. Not only can you do corporate fitness with businesses, but you can also do it with gyms and sports teams. In this case, I'm leaving the gym. I had a poster out in front of the gym. I actually got 3,500 emails and phone numbers from one 15-minute meeting with this gym. Uh, you guys think about it. How expensive would it be to get 3,500 emails and phone numbers on an ad? That's why I'm big on trying corporate fitness before you do anything else. So if you guys want to learn more about corporate fitness, you know, I want a game plan on exactly how to execute this, go to the description of this video, schedule a call with me. I'll share with you the pitch deck that I use so you guys can implement it. And I look forward to talking with you on the call. Take care.